Can the untapped natural resources in developing nations become the key to their economic growth? This question stirs the minds of economists, policymakers, and environmentalists alike. Consider Indonesia, home to the second largest natural forest in the world, or Bangladesh, with its vast potential for agricultural irrigation. Look at the Democratic Republic of the Congo, rich in cobalt and lithium, or Ethiopia and Peru, with their young, fast-growing populations and natural tourism sector. Each of these nations holds a wealth of resources waiting to be harnessed for economic progress. But converting these resources into long-term growth isn't always straightforward. Challenges abound. Unchecked extraction can deplete resources at an unsustainable rate. Pollution can make areas uninhabitable. Corruption can divert revenue away from the public good, and inequality can distort development. In the face of these challenges, careful governance and planning become paramount. A sustainable, inclusive approach is needed. This includes creating wealth funds, preserving the environment, promoting local jobs, and practicing transparency. These measures can help protect against exploitative practices, reduce reliance on global commodity prices, and ensure that the benefits of resource use contribute to a long-term legacy of economic growth. Success stories in this area do exist. Chile, for example, has integrated sustainable practices into its copper mining sector. The United Arab Emirates has used carbon capture technologies and solar parks to reduce emissions from its oil exports. Rwanda has combined habitat protection, conservation education, and ecotourism to boost agricultural productivity. Harnessing natural resources for economic growth is a global imperative. With the right institutional structures and technological breakthroughs, these resources can help raise living standards for billions of people without causing ecological destruction. International collaboration can speed up the implementation of these solutions. In conclusion, natural resources hold vast potential for economic expansion. But this potential can only be realized if principles of openness, sustainability and inclusivity are upheld. While poor governance can lead to inequality and pollution, good governance can bring about prosperity. With global connectivity and technological advancement, the 21st century offers unprecedented opportunities for sustainable wealth generation. It's time to enable natural assets to fulfill their full potential for growth. Okay, that concludes today's journey. I hope you found this video really helpful. Don't forget to hit the like, subscribe and bell button to get notified about our latest informative videos.